Refusa to assent to the electoral amendment bill by President Mohamed Buhari has kept the Senate busy. And barely 24 hours after the President's letter was read in the Senate, the lawmakers say both chambers of the National Assembly will have to agree on how best to respond to President Buhari's rejection of the Electoral Act amendment bill. President of the Senate, Ahmed Lawan, disclosed this at a closed-door session earlier today. The President of the Senate says the provisions of the 1999 Constitution as amended doesn't permit the upper chamber to exclusively take any action on such matters without concurrence with the House of Representatives. However, the House of Reps has embarked on recess to resume in January. He assured his colleagues that a joint position will be reached with the lower legislative house after due consultation with their constituents to determine the appropriate line of action when both chambers reconvene after the Christmas break. The Senate consequently resolve to consult with the House of Representatives in January when both the Senate and the House will be in session. Presently, the House of Reps has gone on recess. And like we all know, the constitutional provision is for the Senate and the House of Representatives to jointly take the appropriate action. The Senate also resolved to consult with our constituents during our recess in January. Thank you.